everyone, I'm Kelsey, and today we're doing the 100 Infant Challenge, a challenge of the Sim 4 where you have one Sim, you're supposed to have 100 children, all with different partners, but it's a speed run. There's some loosey-goosey adjustments to the rules because I just felt like it. This will actually be the last episode of this challenge for a little while. I've noticed that I've kind of run out of fun, new ways to freshen up this series, and I think I just need a little bit of a break, maybe for like a month or so, to just come up with something new. It might be a month. It might be more than a month. I haven't decided yet. I'll let you guys know when I figure it out, but I just figured it's time to kind of let this one rest. It's getting to the point where I like just don't have any good ideas for this series and it's getting a little monotonous. And so I just want to give myself a little bit of time to reset and reinvigorate. So this will be the ultimate episode for now. We are of course at, I think it's like 60 something babies. I honestly lost track. So hopefully Hopefully our editor knows and can put it up right here. Thank you. Oh my gosh, so many babies. We're over halfway through the challenge, but the challenge has been going for almost a year. I think it, I started this challenge in March of last year. Almost a whole year of a challenge is a long time to be doing one. Last time we had children with a celebrity and then they disappeared because I think my mods were removed or something. So we're gonna pop those children back in the household. There were triplets. So we're gonna have to try to raise triplets and get some of these kids kids out of my house. But with these three triplets, that means we'd be up to this number of children in the house. Isn't that exciting? All right, we're here in the 100 baby house. Chelsea is sad because there was a loss. Her One of her children died. We're gotten to the point of the series where our children are starting to die, which is very sad. Gosh, we have so many kids here. Look at this. So let's get our girl pregnant again. We're gonna have to cheat it, obviously. Oh, we don't have the household slots checked off. Okay, so we need need our computer. We need to reestablish our household slots. All right, okay, Chelsea's in labor again. She's got three babies on the way. So let's have our babies and hopefully we will have them this time. Oh my gosh, it's still holidays. Honestly, same Chelsea. I also haven't taken down all my holiday decorations yet. So I feel you, girl. Oh my God, everyone's upset, but they're synchronized and they're crying. I think Chelsea needs to look on the bright side here. Want some help cleaning up all that trash? There's someone that's here that wants to clean for us? Listen, we are down. Oh, hello, Umber Grove. Oh yeah, we flirted with Umber, but then we realized Umber was married. So we're gonna invite Umber in and maybe Umber will help us clean. At least one of the neighbors is noticing. My kids are not being very useful. Okay, it's a girl. And luckily you guys gave me name suggestions in the last video for the triplets since we didn't have them. So this is perfect. I'm gonna go look at your guys' name suggestions. You guys love a theme, I've noticed. Most of the time the name suggestions are having to do with like a television show. A lot of you guys are going for like fruits themes because their dad's name is Orange. What a funny idea, I wouldn't have thought of that. See, this is why I asked you guys for the ideas of the kid's name. So it's a girl. Let's go with P Valencia. Let's go Clementine and then it's a boy. I'm gonna go Orange Junior, just because I think that's funny. And then we got another girl, so we're gonna go with Peach. Peach and Peachishme. <laughs> that's not a name I ever considered for my own children, and now I know that I never will. Here we go. We getting triplets, and Dean is stuck up here, but triple play, we got an achievement. All right, perfect. Let's move Peach into the correct bedroom. Come on over, Peach. There we go. Peach is now in the right room. We have so many kids in the house right now. Are you guys adults? Wait, Lawrence, how old are you? Are you teen? Okay, Lawrence is a teen, that's why. I was like, why are these three triplets, Izzy and Audrey and Maurice still here? Technically, they're not really triplets. They're like twins with like a third child who was also born from the same woohoo, but different pregnancy. It's complicated. But we're gonna have someone come up here and change some diapers here. All my Sims are sad. This is not great. Umber Grove though, cleaning up for us. What a hero. That's so sweet. Thank you, Umber, for cleaning up the house while I add food. And there's like a lot of baby crying. I'm a little nervous to look at that. I will look at the baby babies in just a moment. Ah! Dean is fine. Dean has three fine motor skills, so he needs gross motor. Sam can have more fine motor skills and Dorian is a toddler. So we just have two infants right now. You know, now that I'm done, do you mind if I hang out for a bit? How have your baby been? Yeah, you can hang out for a bit if you really want. It's all good. Let's take our baby downstairs, put him in here. Umber is still cleaning up. Umber, you're my new favorite neighbor. Have I told you that you're the best neighbor of all time? Of all time. All my kids 
kids are doing great, I think. Lawrence, have you done your homework though? No, you have not. Please do your homework, kids. Lacey, you too. Frank also needs to do his homework. We gotta have homework club going on here. And Azriel, our little magical king, should come get some food. Chelsea's taking care of babies up here. Good job, Chelsea. Okay, where is Dean? Dean's downstairs. Dean, do you need anything? No, he's got most things. Okay. Maurice's needs are okay. He's just hungry. Why don't you go get some food, Maurice? And then come over here and do some tummy time with the kids. Sorry. Maurice. It is what it is. Lawrence is doing his homework. Mom is taking care of baby after baby after baby. Gotta make sure all my kids are doing okay. All their needs are terrible. What has happened? What did I do? Chelsea's asleep, so that's impressive. Dean is finally getting some tummy time from big brother Maurice. Yes, Maurice. You know, I always knew I loved you the best, especially since I tracked you down in your infancy from your father. Lacey's getting some food here. Maybe watch some TV while you eat. That might help with your fun. Oh, Azriel's a heavy sleeper. Good, Azriel. Very good for you. Lawrence's homework is complete. Good job, Lawrence. Let's go, Lawrence. Chelsea's feeling pretty happy. I mean, she loves having kids. She's watching her children very happily, getting some sleep while she has a chance. Oh no, what happened, Frank? Someone pee themselves? somewhere. Why are all my kids so filthy? Oh God. Okay. Here's Dorian who's very hungry and very filthy, but he's taking care of business. So go off Dorian. Azriel needs some attention. My sims are a little all over the place. Oh my God. Why is father winter still here? He's in his off duty fit too. He looks like he's just on vacation mode. He does know when they're sleeping and knows when they're awake because he's in the room with them, which is uncomfortable. Maurice is having some cake. Delicious, Maurice, love that for you. Okay, what about Lacey? Lacey's tired, so Lacey, why don't you go up to bed? I think you're sleeping in here. Go up to bed, you're done. Frank, oh my goodness, Frank, what is going on with you? Oh my gosh, take a shower. Maurice just asked Jason a question, that's so cute. Or Jason just asked Maurice a question. Maurice has reached level two of parenting. Go off, Maurice. Maurice is really becoming the king of this challenge right now. Oh wow, Sam just learned something. He put his toe in his mouth. I think that's his last of fine motor skills. Okay, so they both just need their bigger motor skills. Winterfest in July was awful for everyone. Of course it was. It was poorly executed. Chelsea's up. She's taking care of her triplets, doing a fine job. Izzy is okay. Audrey's okay. Maurice is crying in the shower. Emotionally, not okay. Physically, pretty good. Azriel, what do you need to learn? Oh, he needs to learn potty probably. Maybe pull one of these out here. Perfect. All right, we're potty training him outside here. Nothing to see. Azriel's working on it. Dorian's upstairs getting his bath time. Oh, he has little blonde hair. I don't know if I do that because he always has the hat on. Frank is outside sleeping on a bench. Jason actually needs to sleep too. Jason, why don't you go over here? Get a little sleep. Frank, I think you also would sleep better in a bed. Azriel acquired the potty skill. Good job, Az. Let's go, Azriel. Dorian learning some skills here, which is great. Chelsea came out just to watch them. She's like, oh, it's so nice that you're doing flashcards. And then straight back into the babies. Luckily, she's autonomously taking care of the triplets. I haven't had to take care of a single triplet. It's been awesome. Maurice, repair this. Maurice is like, honestly, my second pair. Oh, Chelsea's coming in. Chelsea, if you're downstairs, go eat some food. You never eat anything. Go take care of yourself. Oh, she's not pregnant too. We need to get her pregnant again. Who do you know? I mean, do we have a child with Umber Grove? We are romantic interests. Hmm. Okay, Chelsea's all done with her food, so she's going back up for baby duty. Oh, Dean learned to roll over onto his back. Oh, and Sam's up and he's mad, but mom is already here taking care. Dean is upset because he's trying to go to sleep. Okay, but do you have a new... Yes, okay, he only needs one more gross motor skill and then he can be aged up into a toddler. So at least my infants are going fairly well here. My toddlers, on the other hand, not so much. Oh my God, why are you making messes again? Little Dorian who's running around. 
Asking for flashcards from his big sister. Wait, that's cute. I'm gonna let that happen. That's cute. Oh, he wants more lessons for his basic needs. That's so sweet. I love it. Yes, Dorian's level three of the thinking skill and now he's hungry. Okay, big sister, can you pick up Dorian and take him downstairs since he doesn't have the ability to walk down the stairs yet? He's just a little guy. All right, she's taking him. Oh, and Chelsea's taking a nap and she's up again. Jeez, that did not last long. My adults are actually all pretty good. Chelsea's just needing some sleep as usual. I mean, she is raising triplets pretty much on her own. I'm not helping her very much. Look at my kids all hanging out. Oh, look at them all in the living room. Hello, Chelsea Orange here. I wanted to let you know I just had Trey, a beautiful baby boy. What? Orange had another child? With who? Okay, there's been a blowout. Wow, wow, double whammy here. A blowout and apparently he's with another woman. I thought we were special, but apparently we were not at all. Clementine is crying at Chelsea and she's lamenting on how cute Clementine is. Wait, is someone learning something? Is it your final requirement? What are you learning? Everybody's so excited. Rolling over to Tubby, I think that's the last one. It is. He's got all of his gross and fine water skills. Okay, so one infant down, one to go. Someone's calling Chelsea. Have you heard painting? Paintings at the romance festival is the thing right now. I wanna try it out. Okay, is that my son or is that like a love interest? Who is this person that's messaging me? Yeah, it's my son. What's up? Let's brag about our babies. They're so good. And then we're going to come over and try to seduce someone random. So this is River Sigworth. Okay, we have never met him before. Catherine Link, we've... Oh, I'm assuming she's the daughter of Link. Here's Link. He's got a lot of piercings that he did not have from from the last time I saw him. Honestly, the most attractive person here is my son, which, you know, obviously a problem there. Let's, I guess, dance together. We're gonna dance with our son. He's like, I don't know if I really want my mom with me at the romance festival when I'm trying to romance people. She is too good at romancing. Okay, there's a sim right here. Jaden Price. Oh. Okay, they seem like together and that's very cute. I don't wanna mess with that. Chelsea and her son are having a grand old time having a boogie. She's gonna set off these fireworks instead because I told her to. Ooh, cute. Very cute. Oh, another two. <gasps> wow. That was great. Okay, I guess let's go paint a painting and then we'll see, we'll keep scouting and see if there's anyone. Brandon, Miranda, wait, come back here. Brandon, Miranda. He's looking like an elder. We might kill him if we woohoo with him. Let me see. Hmm. Oh wait, there was someone right here. Okay, who's this? Jace Laurent. Jace Laurent is looking like he could also have a love interest. I feel like the pickings are so slim now in the Sims world. Everyone's like married and having children or like randomly generated. It's just like, oh, it's so hard. But we're having at least a nice mom's day out for a Saturday night. It's kind of nice. All right, I'm gonna go for this guy. He seems cool. Seiji. Okay, we're gonna have like a flirty. Oh no, we'll do an enchanting introduction with Seiji. Let's get in the middle of that, okay? Everybody seems paired up. We're gonna go. We painted our painting, which was the requirement of the evening. So now we're going to romantically introduce ourselves. No, what happened to this interaction here? Yeah, enchanting introduction. Go Chelsea, go. Stop talking to your son, Chelsea. Is he seriously going home? Who am I supposed to seduce out here? This is Bo, it's my own son. I'm gonna go to the new world of Tomarang and hopefully there's some Sims here that I haven't woohooed yet. Let's go to the lounge and hope that we run into some people. Maybe there'll be some new fresh people to woohoo with, have some babies. I think at this lounge there is a hot tub so that will be perfect because then we can just get it all done in one place. Oh, there's someone here already. Oh, and he's pretty good looking. I think he's an elder, but you know what? I'm okay with, uh, he might die, but it's a risk I'm willing to take. Surprise romance, Mr. Arturo. Let me ask you if you're single, sir. Oh, this guy's good looking too. Okay, we found all the good looking men. Oh, he's married, okay. Well, let's, I guess, try someone else. Alon maybe might be single. Alon, Sadia. Okay, he finds us attractive. Let's give a little flirt and exchange a little number. Oh my God, wait, that looks like a wedding ring. Crap. We're gonna ask him if he's single, but at this point, I don't know if I care. <laughs> yeah, he's married. Okay, why don't you and I go over here together? Oh gosh, he's leaving. No, this is the worst. Okay, what if we take Alan somewhere? The night is young, Chelsea. She's like exhausted. It says Alan is sleeping. 
Dang it. Okay, Alan, back to the children. Yay, I love it. I love going back to the children. There's just so many of them. All right, and we're back home and everyone looks pretty rough. Let's see her needs. Audrey just needs to eat something. She's like too sad to eat. Maurice is doing okay. Maurice, why don't you take care of one of the babies, feed Dean and then put Dean to bed. Sam needs also fed. So the triplets are fine. Dorian just needs potty, which is great. Lawrence, you could potty train Dorian. Asriel also kind of needs potty trained. Izzy, potty train as real. Whew, sometimes I love doing all this stuff while I'm paused. My sims just get all the things done. Frank is sad. He says new siblings. He's like, oh, this sucks. Why doesn't she just stop having kids? It's too many kids. I don't get any mom attention. Poor baby. Oh, I feel so bad. But also, you know what? It's part of it, kid. Welcome to being an infusion shime. Oh, he's trying to give himself a pep talk to make himself feel better. Oh my gosh. All right, Chelsea, everybody's taking care of kids down here. Look at all these kids being taken care of. Excellent job, team. Love to see it. The family hustle. We love it. Chelsea, why don't you put Sam to sleep? Put Sam to sleep. I thought you were gonna put him to sleep, but whatever. I guess putting him down there is fine too. Sam, why don't you go to sleep? Yeah, he's gonna go to sleep. And Dean is also going to sleep. Peach is also crying, but don't worry. Mom's on the way, dear. Mom is on the way. She does need sleep, but that's okay. Izzy's potty training. Frank is gonna go for a swim. Frank, did you do this before? Did you go for a swim before without asking your mom? Going for a sad midnight swim. God, I hope he's okay. That, isn't it cold? No, it's warm enough for it. Okay. Maurice got to level two of knitting. He just sat down and he started to knit because he wants to be the Lord of the Knits. He autonomously knitted. That makes me so happy. I love that for you, buddy. Live your dreams. She's feeling energized. Oh my God, who died now? Aaron and Peachishme has passed away. Aaron, not Aaron, Huey pa- We just had a death in the family. Oh, he was our vampire. How did he die? He's a vampire. Wait, he was supposed to live forever. Oh God. I. I don't even want to know. Let's look at the neighborhood stories. Aaron and Peachishme and the Peachishme household has died. Aaron fell for a cow plant's cake bait. He could not have his cake and eat it too. Oh my God. The Peachishmes are gonna be all sad again. This flipping sucks. Maurice and his sister are consoling each other after the death of their vampiric brother whom none of them have met. I don't actually think. Oh, Maurice likes potty humor. He's a knitter who loves Fart jokes. Mm -hmm. Love that for you, Maurice. What a little character you've become. He's just in his white lipstick. That's just truly not the vibe. It's shiny. It just is not looking good. The Sims white lipstick is just not a move that I would recommend to anyone. Sam's awake. Okay, Sam's awake. Does he need, He wait, he doesn't need anything. He's good. It's his brother, Dean, that's behind. Dean, are you almost done sleeping though? Cause like maybe we could just wake you up and have Audrey play with you. Chelsea's decided to come check on him. Okay, well that's fine, Chelsea. Why don't you take him out, put him here? Oh, he's trying to go back to sleep. No, I want to put you over here, Dean. Let's get your stuff done here. Come here, you little squirmy worm. Okay, Chelsea's gonna go take care of some stuff, but why don't you do some tummy time with Dean? Frank is enjoying his little late night swim. Why don't you go home? That's enough, you little weird mermaid boy. Is he a mermaid boy? He is not. Who is the mermaid? Jason's the mermaid. And yet Frank is the one always in the water. <laughs> Their mother is a mermaid. Makes sense why Frank keeps sneaking out to go rendezvous in the water. I guess I shouldn't be as worried about him now. <laughs> Chelsea's dragging herself back out to bed exhausted after taking care of all of these children nonstop. Chelsea, I get you, girl. Unfortunately, I feel like you need to invite a special someone over. That someone is Alan or Alon or Alan. I think it could be Alan, honestly. All right, he's gonna be right over. Yes. Alan, are you coming? Where is Alan? Did he already come inside? 
I don't think he came over at all. Oh my gosh, how rude. We're gonna take care of our crying baby. My kids are feeling good. All my kids have like perfect needs. Still, no Alan. All right, I'm just gonna summon him. Okay, he's gonna be right over. Where are you? Where is he? This is so weird. I summoned him twice. He should be here by now. I need to get pregnant again. It's been several days. There he is, finally. Let's go romance. Okay, let's go embrace him. Ugh. Oh gosh. Why is he immediately over us? What the heck? Okay, why is he embarrassed? Is this why he's not come over? Well, Chelsea's very funny, okay? So we're gonna joke with you. Do some gossip maybe, or talk about interests. Now he's bored with us. What if we just keep complimenting him? I thought we were closer than this. Was it really just, oh! Oh my gosh, he's like bored of us. Okay, Alan is not vibing us at all. Why not, Alan? This is so hard. And of course my toilet just broke. Why are you breaking everything in my house, Izzy? Oh my God, did you break a toilet too? You did. Oh my gosh, all of my Sims are breaking toilets. Okay, he seems to be interested. Oh my God, and the sinks are breaking too. That was four in a row. Tell him a funny story. Why is this such an awkward encounter? It went so easily the first time we talked to him and now it's kind of like the most challenging. Why did I pick the most challenging man to talk to? I thought we would just come over, we'd have a baby and we'd be over with it. Ugh. You know what, you're it too. I don't even like you anymore and I have babies to feed. Thank you very much. I gotta go. Also, my child needs aged up. All of them, to be honest. And look at my child, he's amazing. Who wouldn't wanna have a baby with me? Screw you, Alan. I'm busy being mother of the year. Audrey's chatting with Lacey and Lawrence and also with Frank, how sweet. And oh, with Jason, they're all hanging out in the same room here. Lacey's taking her shower, she needs a shower. Frank needs to go to the bed. So Frank, why don't you go up to bed? Once you're done, Jason also needs to go to bed. I don't know what their deal was that they didn't sleep that much. Dorian's having his food. Oh my God, there's another one. Now it's the shower. Plumbing's gonna be done. Death of me. Chelsea's taking care of all of the babies. Just a true mother of the year. Okay, and Dorian's up. He's like doing okay. All right, he needs his imagination up. So let's have you play a little bit. And then once your imagination's done, we'll get you on the potty. Of course, Alan left because he's the worst. And another thing of plumbing broke and I don't know where it is. Oh my goodness. You're killing me, kids. Chelsea hasn't slept in days. All right, he's level three of imagination. So we need help from Izzy. Izzy, come teach us potty, please. We need, oh God, he undid the tent too. So we need to fix the tent. Can you repair that tent, please? It is some of our kids' favorite tents. I've never seen the tent deflate actually like that. That's so cool. Dean's up, Dean's up, repeat. Dean is up, let's go team. Let's go Dean. Let's give Dean a bubble bath. Dean, we got this, okay? You're getting your bubble bath and then we are trying to get you to the age up age. Dorian looks like he's going to the bathroom all on his own, but I don't think that's true. It's Sam. Sam's going to bed. Dan is very hungry. Dan's like, let me out, let me out, lady. Dorian can now use the potty chair. Good job, Dorian. He's quite a bit behind his brother, but that's okay. We got Peach over here with the triplets. Celebrity triplets, it's not a bad time. And Chelsea looks, oh my God, Chelsea looks so sad. She's like, I didn't get that man seduced. I've hardly ever had anyone tell me no. He was fighting the thing between us and I don't appreciate that. I'm going to leave this one right here. Thank you guys so much for watching the past 30 plus episodes of this series. It's been so much fun to rediscover the 100 baby challenge with infants and see how much harder it is and also have some adjustments to the rules and make things a little a little bit easier. It's still quite a challenging challenge. I do recommend it, but I'm ready to take a little bit of time off to try some new things and try to kind of reignite my love of this series and have some new ideas. So if you guys have ideas how you'd like to spice up this series, let me know in the comments. We'll be continuing with the other series on the channel, Not So Very, along with some new videos as well. So hope that you check those out and I'll see you on the internet very soon. Bye.